building. So how to stay spiritual when you've got a busy work life? Well, the way to stay spiritual is at work, apply spiritual tools constantly while you're at work. Take toilet breaks, uh, you know, use um, spiritual, uh, the, the word is contemplation. So if you've got something like a spiritual thought of the day, like A Course in Miracles, like, um, uh, for example, A Course in Miracles, might, your lesson for the day might be, I pray for a miracle to see this differently. So you could be just going at work, doing your job, speaking to your students, whatever it is. But every, in the background, you're saying at the same time, I pray for a miracle to see my students differently. I pray for a miracle to see my boss differently. I pray for a miracle to see my stress differently. So that becomes a filter in the background as, you, as you're going about your day, doing your work, to just invite spirit, spiritual information and guidance and a reframe uh, so that you don't see things at work from your ego perspective, but uh, invite a higher field of consciousness to, to witness um, the boss from a more divine aspect, to witness yourself and your thoughts in a more di a divine uh, filter. So that would be a thing. So I'd be doing spiritual practice all throughout the day at work. And that's very powerful. And you'll find things will get better and easier at work. And after work and before work, just um, doing lots of spiritual practice to clear any baggage you pick up at work and emotional baggage or thoughts or limited, limiting beliefs and um, you know, praying for those at work, letting go of any limit, limiting thoughts you have around money and work uh, and, and yourself needing to be a perfectionist at work. So letting those go, uh, canceling those beliefs, all of that. And the more spiritual work you can do, the higher your level of consciousness and that will give you immunity and inspiration to intuitively deal with work situations coming up. 